So from here, I've got the four nuts that hold the U-bolts on around the axle. And I've got the shackle bolt. And it'll all fall out from there. So it's just a housing that traps the leaves at the rear of the boat. The problem is, it's very rusty. I've loosened all the, the nuts on the U-bolts, one of them snapped, doesn't matter because I've got new U-bolts, expected them to snap, so now I'm just screwing them down as far as I can with the spanner until the socket fits. A 19mm socket on a half inch row of ratchet, Let's see if that works. So the only two things I have to reuse this little spring spacer and that plate. So that plate I have to clean up and that spring spacer I have to clean up. Now I broke both bits of that new bolt. I didn't break that one. It doesn't matter but new ones. I have to reuse that spacer or that U-bolt clamp and there's a spring spacer here it goes in between the axle and the spring clean them up paint them and put it back together that's the bolt As for stability for the trailer, I've got the stand where I need it so that there's no weight between the stand and the spring, and uh, that's holding the axle. Now I've got two more car stands, or, and that's holding the trailer. That's the, uh, the plate goes underneath the axle for the U-bolts. I have to clean that up and that's the spacer that sits between the axle and the uh, the spring. I have to clean that up. They're the two reusable items. Apart from that, new shackle bolt, new springs, new U-bolts. So the bushes uh, were pretty good, they weren't flogged out at all. The shackle bolts were very rusty, the U-bolts were very rusty and uh, the most dangerous part of all this is on the springs there's little clamps that keep the springs together. These little clamps are what go and when they go the springs separate and that's what buggers you up when you're on a long trip. There's four of these little clamps, two on each set of springs and those clamps were very rusty. It was a good decision to change the springs over.